it's all 17th century French music. It's just gorgeous. And the sonnerie is the last thing on the disc. It's like fire. It's, it's really fiery. I think you'll love playing it. Okay. It's right up your alley. I went from identifying as a femme-identified man mm -hmm. to being a leather man. <laughs> Two extremes, one extreme Quite to the an other. Extreme, yeah, yeah. I met really wonderful men. I just met wonderful, beautiful men who took me in. It was a real brotherhood back then. It was, it was a community of loyalty and honor and integrity and respect and powerful bonding. And that's not what it is anymore. Now it's just costumes. It's like... Add water. Add water and mix. No. Okay, stop a second. The dotted eight sixteenth must be very, very snap, very sharp. Yum, ba bum, ba bum, ba rum, ba bum, 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 bum. I first saw Robert as Scion Flair a few years ago, as he did an impromptu performance overtaking the stage at a popular club in Boys Town. Everyone in the audience was in awe of his energy, passion, and personality as he tore it up to a fierce house beat. It's so funny, all of this is going to be over in five minutes. I know, the preparation. <laughs> You're right, baby. The preparation is everything. But she's uh, five or more pounds. Um, that she's, is amazing. She's very heavy. This is the first one I ever, ever made. And for example, just to show you what I mean, like this is the beginning stages of the idea. And the funny thing is, is a drag queen named Nikki Stevens taught me how to do this from back home in Detroit from Gigi's. Nikki told me to grab a trash bag. I mean, not a trash bag, grab a grocery bag and just build on it. Everything I just explained. But with that knowledge, this was the first piece that I did. And you can tell it's not as defined, it's not as refined as the others that I showed you because I've learned how to improve upon it. But I saved it because I did it so well that it's lasted for five years and she's had very little repair. And I keep her shiny and, you know, glossed up because every now and then I like to bring her out to play. <laughs> I want to make sure that whoever is in my presence enjoys that spirit of communion, so to speak. You know, and I, I'm not trying to sound all priestly like, but you have to start ask. We have to ask ourselves, well, what do we expect when we go to a club? Do we expect some bitch to be up there cussing us out and disrespecting us and saying, "Make some noise, mother all night long? I mean. Some of us are expecting that mentality. The fire burning, there's nothing we can do. Let the fever take you to a place you never knew. The fire burning, and there's nothing we can do. Let the fever take you to a place you never knew. The fire burning, and there's nothing.